Hey Sid, do you know that what you're eating there is actually a mixture? No, I didn't! Yeah, it's because two substances are combined, but they don't form a new substance, and that's because they're heterogeneous, which means that they are different. No way! Hey Callie, did you know that if you put your sugar in your coffee, it becomes a solution? <laughs> Really? Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I think it's because the sugar would be the solute because it's what you put into the solvent, which helps to break down the solute. Yeah, and then wouldn't it become a homogeneous mixture? Yeah. Yeah, because it's it would become one new substance. Then once the sugar is fully mixed in, it would reach equilibrium, which means the sugar and coffee is all mixed in evenly. You know, if you add in both of those sugars, it will change the concentration of it. And, you know, if we just leave it and don't mix it up, it'll actually do passive transport, which means it doesn't require any energy. 